This video explains how to include ebooks in your Works Cited list according to the 7th edition of the MLA Handbook. For more specific information about citing books, like edited or translated books, edition or volume numbers, or individual chapters or essays, check out our video MLA Style Works Cited List Citing Books. Let's get started with citing ebook information. Here, all punctuation is in red for emphasis. In your actual Works Cited list, all font would be black. Start with the author's last name, followed by their first name. Next, enter the title of the book in italics. Then, enter the city of publication, followed by a colon. There's no need to include the state or province. Then the publisher's name, followed by a comma and the year of publication followed by a period. Next, include the name of the database or website you used to access the ebook in italics. For example, eBrary, Springer Link, Project Gutenberg, or Google Books. Then indicate the medium of publication. Medium refers to the format. For most students accessing ebooks through the library, the medium will be web. Web is how MLA refers to any online source or website. Other ebook mediums might include Kobo file, EPUB file, or PDF file. For other mediums, check the MLA handbook or ask a librarian. Finally, indicate the date that you accessed it. Your completed citation will look like this. Notice how the date you accessed it is formatted the day, abbreviated month, then year. See page 235 of the MLA handbook for abbreviations of all 12 months. Where do you find the information you need to cite an ebook? Ebooks will have a title page just like a print book where you can usually find all of the information you need. It will also be available in the online database, in this example, eBrary, where you access the ebook. Or you can look up a library ebook in the library catalog. All of the information will be listed there too. Thanks for watching. For more information about MLA style, watch our other videos or visit the Mun Library's webpage for our MLA guide and to chat live with library staff.